the U.S. Transportation Security Administration, part of the Department of Homeland Security, has spent more than a billion dollars on full-body scanners designed to strengthen airport security. It turns out that at least one model of scanner in use for four years. The Rapers can secure 1,000 full-body scanner. Easily could have been foiled by a savvy bad actor. In addition, it harbored software flaws that made it vulnerable to cyber attacks. That was the conclusion of nine researchers who presented their findings Thursday at the USINIX Security Conference in San Diego. Their conclusions have broad security implications for the deployment of these kinds of devices by the TSA and other government agencies, the researchers said. The team is comprised of members from the University of California San Diego, the University of Michigan and John Hopkins University. While the TSA phased out the Rapers Can Secure 1000 Full Body Scanner last year, it's still used in venues such as courthouses and prisons. Our results suggest that while the Secure 1000 is effective against naive attackers, it is not able to guarantee either efficacy or privacy when subject to attack by an attacker who is knowledgeable about its inner workings, the researchers wrote in their report. While some of the detailed issues we describe are specific to the scanner model we tested, the root cause seems to be the failure of the system designers and deployers to think adversary.